up until very recently, parents have simply assumed that when their children used bathroom and locker room facilities at school, they were using these facilities only with those of the same biological sex. In this way, we have long provided students with a measure of privacy and protection from having to be self-conscious. Um, however, our schools, uh, if you pay attention to the news, have recently become somewhat of a battleground for gender politics in a way that threatens both the privacy rights of the majority of students and the safety of the minority of students. At least one school in Kentucky has seen fit to change the long-standing policy uh, on these facilities to allow students who identify as another gender than their biological gender to use the facility of their choice. This not only violates the privacy of the average student, it threatens the safety of those it purports to protect. Uh, we too are concerned for students who may be harassed, but we should make sure that the policies we put in place to redress that problem don't make the problem worse.